Aries, welcome to your next lucky break reading. Um, we're going to look into, well, my main meditation with Archangel Michael was um, like money finances. So that's where I'm focused on. So if love um, and friendship or anything else comes through, I'm going to pick that up. But my main focus on this reading is um, finances. Okay, so it looks like we have 11th house with Sun and Aquarius with idealism. 50 with 12th house introspection and 45 reclaim um the fifth house represents spontaneity also wheelhouse of um leo and nine is the wheelhouse of sagittarius which is also learning a uh, higher learning and basically it's more of like the harafant kind of energy it looks like you've been really delving into in like friendship groups and i'm getting like drown out voices i don't know if it's your voice that's being drowned out or it's more of um your ideas are not being um heated uh and it looks like you're in deep introspection here someone could have jupiter or neptune in their 11th house and it's a retrograde placement or that's in transit right now in the, your 11th house. But it looks like you're seeing the bigger picture here where um, you're not being heard. Your ideas are not being heard. And it looks like you want to kind of move forward and away from this. Um, I think you got the sign or the enlightenment that you're wanting. And... I'm getting like strategizing how to move out of this. So let me get your Oracle cards. We have eight with old car, weary, retired, exhaustion, bone tired, needs restoration. So that's um, eighth house in, uh, that's Pisces. And we have third house. So this is communication, crack shot, competent, superior, precise, expert, sharp tongue, witty, clear cut. Okay, so this is, an old car is eighth house so death rebirth and it looks like you had a blocked throat chakra or this is media social media um, publication is where you're focusing at or you're going to set someone straight whatever this is you're um, heading towards a different direction and we have another eight with magician in the mirror you're manifesting a new life or you could be dealing with someone literal like hocus pocus kind of thing where they give you promises and there's no um, execution with it all ideas and no product um, okay let me get your tarot cards more of the oracle we have the rebel limiting beliefs are limiting your abundance setbacks taking one step forward to make two steps back and sharing giving back and sharing your gifts with others so it looks like you're again you're getting drowned out whatever this is if you have a voice that you need to use be it singing um or making poetry uh what else can you use your throat chakra also um if you need to write something as well it looks like you're again moving away from this friendship group because it looks like not only has it been like setting you back two years even it's time to go back to uh, it's time to go to the next phase of your life um, let me get your tarot cards we have ten of cups family business home life domestic security strength the fool two of cups six of cups and six of wands okay so you've been in embroiled in a friendship group business organization or it's more of a business partnership with specifically from with one person it looks like it's really kind of blocking your abundance in a way where you feel like you owe this person something but you've outgrown this kind of group setting um aries it's time to move forward towards this full um you could want to travel somewhere or start a business somewhere where it's a little bit tropical but you're wasting your skills whatever this is um 
if you've been in if you've been in organization because right next to shrimp i don't know if it's a military or something government um maybe it's time to retire that life for something new uh because what looks like the next phase of your life is really beautiful um not only will you find um true love someone that you could really this could be a childhood friend or a past life soulmate but i'm seeing like a very healthy love life and as well as business endeavor let's get here astral house we have career so i think you've done one phase of your career and you want to head towards another one let's see we have when you're happy achieve, achieving true independence worth waiting for analyze learn and prepare first and cancer season cancer could be of significance here or cancer season is when starts shifting uh for for the better for you let me get tarot cards this is going to be a birth of what business is this because happy What's the next lucky break? Archangel Michael for Aries, please. What is this? Six, six. Six to six could be significant. Okay, we have Ten of Pentacles. King of Swords. So you're leaving that Ten of Cups towards Ten of Pentacles because it looks like it wasn't, again, your voice was getting drowned out and it looks like there's just no way around it is to move forward so where you're heading towards next is um building life or business with someone that also has a very um i'm getting like a acumen so if you have the brains this person will have like action power so if you have the action power this person will do the brainy work so do all the paperwork and you do all like marketing i don't know how that will work uh we have nine of wands but it looks like the moment you set your mind to it and really head towards it this is when things will start unfolding we have harfont the devil Seven of Swords. Okay, so whatever you're heading towards, Aries, uh, you should not tell people about this. I'm getting this is like the Ten of Cups energy right underneath, so it could be a friendship group. Uh, we had Magician in the Mirror. So try to, if you don't want to leave this place yet, or you have like, let's say if you put in your notice, um, don't say anything where you're heading towards because this could lead to a backlash on your end um i'm not getting you're stealing someone's ideas but for some reason they will find a way to kind of derail your stuff so i don't know what this ten of pentacles is for you let me get more oracle cards but it's business with someone but someone person of air so this could be again with an Aquarius autumn and it could be happening anytime soon or around Libra oh it is Libra season right Scorpio so it should be three days three weeks again it just now it's gonna transpire very soon give it all the way to Sagittarius season or maybe all the way to um, February but be silent, be still with Seven of Swords. Usually it's not because there's drama and you have to hide whatever this is. If you look at the devil here, it looks like this mask you're going to put on is going to help you out of this situation. So be silent, be still and just leave quietly and um, to avoid conflict. I don't know what this is, but it looks like career related on you. Okay. Um, let me get guidance and I'll end your reading. So you're leaving the Ten of Cups for Ten of Pentacles 
stability. This is more of career wise. If the Ten of Cups is more of like, I don't know, like a family business or like an organization with a group of friends, or let's say if you're like in military, like band of brothers, those are your family. So it feels like that Ten of Cups soul tribe feeling, but it looks like you've outgrown this and it's time to go to your next phase, which is Ten of Pentacles. Okay, we have 17 it's time to play you're working too hard and worrying about everything seek out joyous experiences to bring back balance in your life and we have six be the real you your greatest power comes from being who you truly are don't let anyone sway you from expressing your authentic self so this is all i have for you aries um i wish you guys lots of love abundance happiness and don't forget to like and subscribe bye have a great week